Welcome back everyone to Old World Blues, a disease series in which we're playing as a capitalistic microhaven of Dundrum. We're going to go to war and expand on our capitalistic natures uh, with bank and bandits. See if we can have a good old time with them. But after they're done, we're going to go to war with the Bad Purple Brigade just so that, uh, because we can. And we'll start attacking from the top too. As we're cleansing our lands and we'll have an elite takeover. More political power, more stability. It's not to love. Become an elite person? Why not? We have 26 divisions, they're all infantry, unfortunately. As we are slowly trying to make some uh, special horses. Which would be a pretty darn nice. 250 power, go over here, do this, thank you very much. And we're making two more divisions at a time, which is not a bad thing, but it's going to take a little bit of time to go to war with them. So, in the meantime, let's train. Apologies to the Apocalypse, that's fine, let them come in. They can, they can do whatever they want for the most part. Because right now we have a max that's all out. I might get rid of anti tank eventually for mobile fortifications. Perhaps? Yes? Probably? No. Uh -oh. Game's gonna crash, maybe? Yeah, it might just crash. Um, give me a second So, here. the game really did end up crashing, which kinda sucked, but, uh... Let's see if we can go to war these guys. At this point, we have fighters for every single group. Well, okay, maybe not every single group. Uh, close to every single group. We don't have any cast yet, but we're working on it. And what we should really be working on next is probably a uh, forming department here. But we're slowly moving into the Bat Purple Brigade. After them, I'm gonna build the Strath Commune. Sync Coalition, probably Elbow. That'd probably be the one that we should probably assault next. Of course, they establish themselves, which is fine, because we got plenty of political power. I'm not even gonna care what we do. We're gonna do all of that. Thank you very much. And up next, I want you guys to actually focus here. How about just taking out the line, because there's just a waterway or the river down this direction, so we definitely want to. Uh, Get rid of that. This way, once we're in there, we'll be fine. And let's see. Army supplies. Do we not have enough? At least three? We have more. At least three, don't we? I'm pretty sure we do. Well, maybe it doesn't register in this part of the armory or inventory, but still. I know we do. Oh, wow. Well, force defense, huh? Well, let's certainly move. But he should be learning how to fight over a river, right? These guys... Hopefully, we're out of manpower, unfortunately. Becoming Winter Specialist, at least. That's nice. Uh, old World Tactics. I'm going to grab some tactical awareness and mapping. Good. I get over there. We're going to form a department. Nice. And we need to do that and uh, elbow. And then these guys over here, too. Pretty good. More organization. Good, really, that one's good to get down. That's going to take a, it's quite a bit of a grind, but we got a lot of political power, and I would really like to core a lot of this stuff up here, too. So, uh, keep it right there. Good. Another special forces division? Great. Complicate circuitry, grab some radio, even more coordination to help destroy every division that's on top. right there. I and mean, we've lost quite a few guys, but that's why we actually lost more than they have lost. So I threw on camp companies just in case too. But uh, yeah, we've got enough here. Or do I get rid of these and then it'll pop back in here? Probably not. Recon snipers. Oh, it does. Nice. 15 days. Okay, that makes more sense. And we'll do that too. Come out right here so we can destroy these divisions. Or this division. Right, or not really destroy, but weaken it. And then push it further down south and north. That's the goal. Come on, and we almost have them. There we go. That should help us out definitely here. And here too. Interception. Good, good, good. I mean, if they want to die, I mean, they're allowed to. It's fine with me. Halfway done. Thunderbirds. 50 is good. Get that, more defense. Go up there so you don't have to fight over the waterways. Do we have any cast yet? Yeah, we do. Not much. 
But it's a start. Good. There's going to be a small little snowball effect. It's all right. It's all right. We can always recover what we're losing here. Um, in the meantime, I forgot to do this too. That's our battalions. That'd be good. Special Forces integration. Grab some more hardware and hardness for our guys. Nice. Good. Nice. Now we're still going in, no matter what. And also, we have quite a bit of a. Uh, a few screening ships. I don't always leave them for manpower. It's not like they have a lot of manpower on them anyways, but still. Damage reduction against cast, division defense, intelligence gained from combat. It's not bad. There we go. Oh, artillery barrages. Don't mind if we uh, try to do. Keep breaking them. That's all I can ask. Well, that definitely gave us way more green. Ah, that definitely lost more than we have now. Just good, good, good. Just about right there. You can take that towel. That's probably the most important one. Can you make it more? More propaganda? Sure. Do military signing bonuses. I'm gonna get 35. Is that a trade node? I really, we we really need more trade nodes. Uranium City wouldn't be bad either. Probably good to go to war with them too. Not bad. Not great. Not bad. I think these guys would be pretty tanky overall, but still. Spin packs are nice. More HP for those medevac units. And there, level 5 is good. Uh, we could go for that, why not? Ah, Tlalox Demise. That's a beautiful thing, unless you're Tlalox himself. And we get almost two political power every day. So, overall, not bad. More organization for our soldiers. Very organized. 3,000 versus 2,000. 3,400. 2,000. Not bad. Refined tools. Um, manpower. Yeah. I'll put this one too. Multi purpose equipment. Over here, we're going to grab. Uh, Hearts are stability a little bit, but steam donkeys. Because why not? Any damage? A uh, slight bit, not too much, but a slight bit of damage is being done. Point defense strategy is good. Just grinding through these guys quickly. More speed is good too. Become, still becoming a winter specialist, but it's taking forever. Literally no men to spare. Good. Yeah, at this point they just don't have enough to strength. They have quite a few divisions. If they were properly equipped, they would be able to do something, but unfortunately for them, it doesn't look like it. Blow the cannons? Yeah, why not? Keep making more. I wish you just I wish you could just like auto make them, that'd be kinda nice. Oh boy. Are we missing anything besides manpower? Uh fire teams, support equipment. Yeah, we got enough radio guesses too. Go one more there. Uh, go two more there too. Should probably continue on with this. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. Don't reinforce faster. It's fine. Get to Batford. The one thing that's going to limit us right now. They 
with 19 divisions, they're out of manpower, stockpile, they're out of guns, no men. I'm gonna just die. Ah, war sport. Nice. Made it back. It's a lot of time still. Better recon? Sure. Good. Sons of Vulcan are gone. Nice. A lot of divisions there. A lot of divisions all over the place here. Uh, how about that? Got that already. We'll go with awareness. Hey, we actually broke over. Look at that. Nice. Imminent raid from the Rupert's Trading Company. You know what? Instead of going to war with the Uranium City. Okay. Marching drills, long distance movements, and whatnot. God dang, this is a grind though. Killing a 5,000 of them, probably two to 3,000 of our own men. But with them under us, that's pretty nice. All right, let's get over here. Let's book it. Wilderness survival training is good. That's still pretty much all ahead of time. We're gonna grab some of this. We're gonna get some more special forces equipment. Go ahead and go to war. They might attack us, or maybe not. If that's the case, we'll go this way too then. We're gonna go to war with the Uranium City in a little bit. Huh? I like 100%. Oh boy, it's expensive. But it's probably worth it. Let's go in. Give me a guess. Nice. And they're falling apart already. Exactly what we want to see. Oh, now it's glitched. Dang it, we can't see that now. to build. Nice. Oh yeah, are we still on? Oops. Well, I was waiting for world tension to get to 60%, which it is. And it was more than 40% of the factories. Oh, crud. I should have done that one earlier. You know what would be nice? If you could just switch to that focus. It's like, like we're elites. Like, do we really care what the people think about, about us too much? Not really, no. Like, if you could switch to every cap for the army, but take, like, a stability hit, I think that'd be fair. I think that'd be interesting. More than than just what we have right now. I think that'd be, gameplay-wise, role-playing-wise, much more fun. But maybe that's just me. Are you guys all allied with each other? Oh, yeah. They're just puppets. We got them. Not really surprised, but whatever. Russian machines. I'm going to serve because we can. Good on grenades, good on a lot of stuff. It takes forever to get all that stuff. Well, that's the usual. Plenty of manpower now, which is nice. Grab some of that. Maybe not plenty of manpower. A decent amount of manpower. Good. Up next is the scoop. A getaway gang. Well, they're not going to get away from us. Pretty easy. Hey, another trade node. Or equipment, recon kits, naval stuff. Alright, what can we do up here? I 
Actually... Ooh. Not ideal. Um, demos... It's fun. Can we throw on one more since we got rid of another division? Yes, we can. Can we throw on one more maybe? No! Whatever. Well, you see what you can do. Should be able to pierce enemy divisions, but now we're not going to win up here because there's probably only one division attacking up that direction. I am correct, unfortunately. Um, oh. Work on that stability, yes, please. It's a little two at a time. Let's grab this in. More breakthrough, yes, sir. Good. Oh boy, is it taking us some time though? Uh, fighters are not bad. Honestly, fighters aren't my biggest priority. Triplane attackers are. It's just production. Grab some of this just in case we need it for the future. Encouraging women to serve is fine for now. Groot, uh, caravan guards. Stonks, nice. Look at nice farming is good. Because I'm just worried about energy cells for a little bit for now. Ooh, let's grab some of this. Grind it out, baby. Grind her out. So how strong are these guys? Getaway gang. 20 or 30 divisions. Least amount of manpower. More than us. The pass. What type of pass are we talking about? Capitalistic Microhaven of Dundrin? Nice. Well, let's see real quick anyways, too, just because we can, because we should do fine. And if you need some help, I should probably have done that from the beginning. But oh well. It's probably just planes we're fighting up here in. Get more recovery rate if you need it. Oh, we actually did take it a tough. Finally. Supply is not so bueno, though. Um, is there a supply node? Oh, this one's a supply node. Oh, and they did force defense. Of course they would. I mean, it makes sense. Camp Pearson, we should probably research more anti-tank then. That would help out. Easterville, huh? Quite a bit of money. Yeah, how about the settlements? Ninety three every month, not bad. Yeah. Oh, so with this one, give it a couple more days. And the railroads supply will be in here. Good. Should help out everybody here, and actually it should hurt them. Yeah, maybe not so much. It depends on how much supply they're using. Nice. It's like they don't really lose strength, they just lose organization, which kind of sucks for us. Guards, plenty of manpower, hire some gunsmiths, care of militias, get some more piercing next, because oh we can actually we're doing okay on piercing. 0.83 anything eh, else? We can grab this one. Why not? Now we're doing a little better. Recon scout team kits, good. Grab some of that. And what else? Let's save that for a little later. Aid wouldn't be bad, but I want to core more. Like right here. Is it worth a lot? Not really, but we'll core it anyway since we're still waiting to destroy these guys.
Oh, completely instrument. Nice. It's really good. More soft attack, yes. Repair the ships, even though it really, literally doesn't even matter. And now that we're done, we'll be done with that. Then we'll go back to Uranium City. After Uranium City, maybe none of it, and call it a campaign, maybe. Because why not? Hello. Oh, nice. We got a new guy here. Show field commanders. Um, we'll give you less losses. Good, good. Become inspirational. We need inspiration, inspirational people in our lives. So this is gonna suck. Um, with them doing it like this, uh, we were doing okay. Now we're doing okay, definitely. But keep building it up. Mm, sure, we'll use more stability. Why not? Even mole recovery rate. How many things do they have? Seventeen max. They're completely out of everything, though. Delicious. Actually, yeah. There's some gunsmiths, subsidize them too. 100%, so pretty, that's pretty nice. There. Yeah, just straight up destroying them now. I mean, they'll keep fleeing the divisions back in, but they're so low in organization that actually damaging them, damaging their strength would be good too. Platoon training. Oh, harness and eh? all that stuff is good. Very, very good, and we'll finish this off. Right now, now, finally, we're at war with the Uranium Group, and it shouldn't take too long as they immediately force defense, but, uh, you know, we'll see. We'll definitely see. Uh, I haven't really used too much of, um, oh, look at the broken masks. Uh, what is it? Ciphers. I haven't really used ciphers too much. Slowly, slowly, slowly trying to break them, but that's alright. We're out of badges, are we? Oh, good. Oh, we need more command power, probably. Yeah. That's what we really need. Um, yeah, war sport. I always use war sport unless I have enough war sport. War sport is pretty important. But in the meantime, put a war with none of it next, just so that we can uh, focus on them and then call a campaign, like I said earlier. Which would be an ideal thing. Now we're no longer fighting. Is that a waterway? I don't think that is. Oh, we'll be fine. 78 army XP. Don't mind grinding a little bit, just so that we can get stronger divisions, more organization. The good stuff. I always call it the good stuff. There you go. Adoption armory, nice. And airbase construction, sure. Oh, this part's gonna take a while, a little while to do it, isn't it? Especially as they literally just have bad grief. Versus Raphael Benton. Now we do have Cass helping us out, which is good. Huh. Oh, now it's dropping. There's nothing they can do. They, just, they literally just sit there and take it. As we are slowly getting a little more arm air XP every day. Not for very, not very much at all, but very slowly. As the divisions are literally just dying there, because there's nothing they can do. As we have an intel advantage, even though we're fighting forts, and we have air support. Easy. Nice. Ah, I got a couple more radios. Didn't really need them, but it's alright. Now we should have uranium, right? Hopefully. Alright, you guys go there. You'll be fine. You guys go there. You'll be fine. Not worried about it whatsoever, you guys. Um... Oh, whoop, whoopsie. We gave it to the wrong person. Oh, well, who cares? It's fine. It's not like anybody can really do anything against us anyways at this point. Not really. Go, 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 and go when you can. Ah, we got none of it done too. Nice. Good stuff. Put 
More days? They do have power armor. Interesting. Oh. Whoops. Guess we gotta just fire. But it's only 15 days. We've got some rifling to do as well. Soft attack, 6%. It's not much, but it's not bad. So 15 army XP. 77 is not bad. Breakthrough is 55. Defense is, I mean, infantry is just vastly superior in defense and offense. Heart attack's okay. Air attack doesn't really matter. Recovery is okay. HP is pretty good. Organization is decent. Reliability is okay. Um, anything else? Initiative. 31%. That's, that's a lot of initiative, actually. Yeah. The higher the initiative a unit has, the quicker it can get reinforced in battle, and the quicker it gets its planning done. Initiative also multiplies any coordination modifiers you may have. Nice. Cool. Go to town on them. And use a cipher. Did not forget about it this time. At least this time. There we go. Go ahead. Go ahead. Airbase construction. And we're going to go with this one. Good. We can definitely go with this. Six. Good. Well, then, political power in Saskatchewan. Wow, we are moving past. Oh, you don't have any orders. My bad. Yeah, I can't imagine people up here in none of a country would have a lot of orders. Cool. And just go as a group. It's fine. Hold hands if you need to. I think we'll be okay. Hopefully. Else, core, 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 core. No, what well, we maybe core this one over here? It's not bad. 80. It's pretty decent. Start coring more stuff around here too. 90. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. And we're just going in, having a good old time. I wish it still wasn't glitch, but whatever. But yeah, overall, starting off Dundurn is not great. Like most nations in Old World Blues, it really doesn't have a good start. As I'm exploring every single, literally every single nation that's available for now in Old World Blues. Uh, but uh, it's not bad. It's really not bad. That's in a pretty good starting position. You can get really screwed over in the beginning, though, with trying to unite everybody around here. But overall, the capitalistic micro haven of Dunder is not a bad nation to play or try out. So if you enjoy the campaign, please consider leaving a like. It does help me out. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. I guess if we never got elbow. Oh, well. I guess see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous, tremendous rest of... Your day.